Hi, I'm Lisa Nyland from Atwell Solicitors and I'm a property law expert. I'm here to talk to you today about the difference between exchange and completion and how long there usually is between both. Exchange and completion are two very different stages in your conveyancing transaction. Exchange of contracts is where you become legally committed to either buy or sell your property. Completion is the day that people physically move. This is the day that the cash transfers take place in between the solicitors and keys are released. Exchange of contracts is when all parties are ready to commit to their transaction. The buyer is ready to buy and the seller is ready to sell. This also includes that their conveyancer has completed all of their legal work and they are ready to exchange. Exchange is just that. Each party's contracts are exchanged. It's on exchange that a completion date is also agreed between the parties, and this is the legally binding date that each, each party will be moving home. It's usual to have a week between exchange and completion because this is the time period that most mortgage lenders require in order to release mortgage finance to the buyer's solicitor. Completion is the day that everybody physically moves home. This is the day that the buyer's solicitors send funds to the seller's solicitors. Once the seller's solicitors have received funds, they will telephone all parties, including the estate agent, to release keys. Completion typically takes place round about midday, and this is the time that everybody should be aimed to be packed up and ready to go. Any questions in relation to buying or selling your home, then please do not hesitate to contact me.